I'm Dr. Khalid, and in this video, I'll explain to you what an ALT blood test is in the simplest and maybe the weirdest analogy you've ever heard. Trust me, I'm, I'm a doctor. So an ALT blood test is part of your liver function test, also known as LFTs. Your ALT is high if you are a man and if it's above 50 international units per litre. And if you're a woman, it's high if it's over 40 international units per litre. Now there is a lot of variability between different countries and different labs, even within the same country. And the difference is usually between the technique they use, the chemicals, and also how they process it. I've seen anything between zero and 55 being normal for men. And for women, it's more between zero and 40. So what does the ALT actually say about the liver? Well, I want you to come on a journey with me. Imagine your liver is a bustling city. Let's name it Liveropolis. A place where all sorts of vital activities are happening day in, day out. And sometimes at night time, slightly more shady activities go on. Now, now in every city you need a superhero, and in Liveropolis the main superhero is called ALT Man. And yes, I couldn't think of anything catchier than that. Now, ALT Man's superpower is that it keeps the city safe. He zips around Liveropolis, making sure that everything is running smoothly. Picture him flying through your blood vessels, wearing overly tight spandex liver suit, mentally scarring everyone that comes across him. Disney, if you want him to be in the next poorly CGI'd Marvel movie, you know where I'm at. Now, Liveropolis can get pretty chaotic sometimes, especially when Liverpool somehow wins a football match. Thankfully, that rarely happens. But when the city faces a threat from, say, a mega villain like Alcoholius, the Booze Bandit, or from Greasy McGreaseface, the Fat Depositor, then ALT Man starts working extra hard, and his stress levels begin to go up and up. And because of this, he has to be all over the city, left, right, and center, fighting crime everywhere. And understandably, because of this, his stress levels go up. So when your doctor orders an ALT blood test, they're essentially checking up on ALT man's stress levels to see if Liveropolis is actually in imminent danger. And so high ALT levels are like the liver's emergency alarm going off, signaling that our liver needs more help. So what does our liver actually do and why is it important? Let's go deeper into Liveropolis and see what role it has in the body and what are the key jobs it does. The very first one is Metabolism Valley. Now, very much like Silicon Valley, there are tiny little startup companies with their own processing power that's sifting through your blood, processing and metabolizing nutrients. The next one is Manufacturing Corner. As well as breaking things down, the liver also makes things. The most important one of this is something called bile, which is a key product in helping us digest fat. The liver also produces cholesterol in our body and proteins that help our blood clot. So Liveropolis has its own detoxification depot where ALT Man is the chief inspector and he cleans up toxic waste from environmental hazards to overpriced cocktails that you bought in London. And finally, picture a gigantic nuclear power plant where ALT Man is like the quality control manager. The factory stores energy in the form of glycogen ready to be released when your body needs a boost of productivity. And so if ALT man is struggling and his levels are too high, then as doctors, we do a few things. First, we take a history from the patient to see if it could be a cause for this. Is the patient feeling unwell in any way? Are there any medications that could be damaging their liver? Do they drink too much alcohol? We also then go on to examine the patient for signs of liver disease. If you tap up here, I've done a video about skin signs that come with liver disease. We would also look at a few other blood markers, including the rest of your liver function tests. And as everybody knows, no superhero works completely alone. The Liver Avengers team includes AST Woman. I kind of ran out of creative names long ago. Billy Robin, get it, Robin, like Batman, and I'll see myself out. And of course, Gamma Gin and Tonic. 10 points if you can guess what causes a high Gamma GT. I'll cover all of this in next week's video. In the meantime, here's a video about signs to look for if your liver is starting to fail. So click on the next video and peace out.